So we got to Madrid three days ago and we drove to Orense. It was about a five hour drive. We rented a car. I was jet lagged as hell. And uh, it was probably a bad idea. Right now we're going back to Madrid to see my brother, and my mom, and my nieces. And we're taking the train. So we're gonna compare how expensive it is, how easy it is, and if it's a better idea to drive or take the train, we're going to and from Madrid. I'm Sean. And I'm Lainey. <laughs> this is days we make mistakes. <laughs> oh, this is days we spend. So here we go. Walking to the train from our place took about 20 minutes. Orense is a pedestrian friendly city and we packed light, so it was easy. Estaciones de trenes. The good thing about train travel is that you can show up just a few minutes before your departure with no stress. Boarding is super easy. You have a coach and a seat number assigned. Also, don't forget your mask. Masks are still required on a lot of public transit in Spain. And the seats are spacious and comfy. The tickets for our high-speed train from Orense to Madrid cost 21 euros each. And the total round-trip fare was 93 euros for two people, which included travel on a Saturday. It also took us around two and a half hours to get to and from Madrid, with two stops that I can remember. It even has a bathroom and a cafe car, so you can arrive pretty fresh. The best part about taking the train is the ability to just zone out. You can nap, look at the scenery, catch up on a book, listen to a podcast, eat a sandwich, do whatever. Super easy ride. We took a nap. Kind of cold. It's freezing. On the it's pretty cold. Bring a sweater, but very easy. I fell asleep and I woke up in Madrid. <laughs> <laughs> good ride? Yeah, really easy. In general, coming from Madrid is a little bit more tricky because there's security and it's a bigger station. You kind of have to know where you're going and it takes a little longer to get to the station. But going to and from these smaller stations and these smaller towns is just so easy. Just walk on the train. So which is better? Do you like driving or the train? Oh, uh, the train's way better. Don't get a car. <laughs> the only reason to rent a car is if you really want to see things along the way or if you want to see things after you get there. But it's very easy to get the train. It's much more affordable. And uh, you can take a nap instead of driving for five hours. There's surprisingly a lot of tunnels on the train. Mm. Yeah, so it's not very scenic. You don't see as much as you think. Yeah. I swear this isn't the same video as when we left. It's the next day. <laughs> I'm Lainey. I'm Sean. And that's the day we spent. Oh, <laughs> best tense. I like it.